Dina Bottas and Ty Cameroni. And today on Mathematical Mo News, we are researching factor, factor trees. trees. Dinosaur, what is a factor tree? Well, a factor tree is a process used to break down any numbers into its prime factors. Can you give me an example? Um, let's try 10. Tell me the tell me what multiplies into 10. Oh, 1, 2, 5, and 10. You just solved a factor tree. Yay! Yay! We're back at Mathematical News. I'll do the factor tree on number 12. And I'll do it on number 20. Okay, Ty. So what two numbers go into 12? 4 and 3. Correct. Is 3 a prime factor? Yes. Is 4 a prime factor? No. What two numbers go into 4? 2. Here it is, ladies and gentlemen. What is 2 times 2 times 3? 12! Yay! <laughs> now over, over to, to you. you on number 20. Okay, Dino. What goes into tw 20? Mm, 4 and 5. Good. Okay. Is 5 a prime factor? Yes. So we go 5. It's 4. No. Good job. What goes into four? Two. So two. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. There we have solved number 20. What's two times two times five? It equals 20. 20. Yeah. Mathematical news. Here's Dinosaur Bontis, and we're doing our first word problem. What is the prime factorization of 48? Break it down to six. And eight. Can we go further? Yes, we can. So, here it goes to four and two. What about six? Three and two. Are, is there a composite number here? Only one. That's four. We could break that down to two and two. And these are the prime factors of 48. Yay! Mathematical news. Ty wants $16 in coins only. So we're going to do factor trees to break it down. So, what goes into 16? Well, 4 and 4 does. Then we're going to break 4 down even farther. And that goes to 2 and 2. Same for the other side because it's 4. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here these four numbers here all equal to 16. And I get them all in coins. Thank you. Yay. We are back at Mathematical News. Today... Two customers walked into Dinosaur Bank, and they, and I I have to try to find the greatest common factor to give them the right amount back. But this bank only sells five dollar bills, so we need to find out what the common number is between these two numbers. So five times five equals twenty five. Now, Dinosaur, I'm going to try to let you do number ten. So there are two different customers. And they want two different amounts of money. So how are we going to give them their money back? Well, 10, 2, times 5, he equals 10. And so now that we found the numbers, we found that the common number between these two numbers are the number 5. Yay! 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 News. And we are prepared a song for you to remember about factor trees. Oh, factor trees, oh, factor trees, we multiply all the primes. Oh, factor trees, oh, factor trees.